Hey guys, so we are right here in Ash. Uh, oh my God. Auburndale. Auburndale. No, Ashen Sport. What? Ashen, Ashen Water, Water Sports. And uh, it, so he's it's stop, like, stop. Ashen Water Sports. Action Water Sports. Ashen in Water Auburndale, Sport. Florida. Ashen Water Sports. <laughs> That's the intro, bro. That's done. Hey guys, we're right here at Auburndale, Florida. And you know what? He's gonna do the intro. Hi. David, come hey on, guys, do your thing. Do welcome your thing. to another amazing adventure with Alex. We're yeah, save at the Action video. Water Sports in Auburndale, Florida. I'm David. Save, save the video, bro, because I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm done. <laughs> I inspired like two hours ago. Yeah, Alex is just worn out. Anyway, this is the the 2020 Hobie Compass. Now this is the camouflage version, so it's a really nice little boat that they put together with a few features uh, from Hobie. And, and David, give me a second. Let me record from this side because the the sun it wasn't helping all right so this is a new 2020 the new 2020 hobie compass all right so 12 foot boat 12 foot okay so this is like their original budget kayak mm -hmm. right but, but it's it's nicer than the budget now it's nicer <laughs> than the budget but this yeah. one is the top of the line yeah right so yep. t tell so me what why. is new it's why. got the this one has the uh mirage drive it's the 180 reverse so you have, of course, the the reverse. But what's new is the new kick-up turbo fin. So you're let me see the action. Come on, come on. Heading along, that. and then you hit something, and it folds up. It goes over the log and comes back down. It comes back once you start going again, right? Yeah, when you start going again, it comes back down. Wow. Let me tell you something. That drive is amazing, mm -hmm. and it only weighs like eight pounds. Yeah. Compared to the other propel style it drive, it is. It's lighter. It's much lighter. Yeah. Super light. Clicks and they're in. super expensive. Now, you were talking about before why these boats are so expensive. Because this is a, this is a true roto-molded kayak. It's a one-piece roto-mold. Um, it's built very, very solid. Made in America. Made in California. Uh, from Hobie. That's they, it. Made in California. That's all you needed to know. That's why it costs like $3,000. <laughs> it's expensive. Yeah. Well, <laughs> I think it costs like 600 just to send it here from California. That's one thing. In Florida, we have to pay the highest freight rates. Mm -hmm. We have to bring them all the way across the country. So they, they cost more in Florida than in other places, I guess, because of the freight is so expensive. But really, if you've ever owned a Hobie, it's worth every penny. So, mm -hmm. so what do you think about the, the seat? Uh, a lot of people complained that the seat wasn't good enough and that it, it was breaking. What was breaking was this, and this could easily be replaced. Yeah, we, I haven't had anybody break it in the cup of seats so far. Mm. Seems to work work very well. I like the way that the rudder is now is built inside the boat. I can I can pull this lever. This, can you see that? Yeah, yeah. Down. Yeah. So that makes it easy. But it's built in, and when it's when it is down, it just it's very free. It and it free. and it turns on the dime, right? Yeah. It, oh yeah. There's pretty amazing and, and i really like that hobie adds this sacrificial place right here because if you're dragging the kayak i mean this is very important like if it's if it's something if it breaks you just replace it pretty good the msrp on the hobie compass camo is 24.49 it costs more money because of this right here the drive this is pretty much yeah. the only thing that changed right because you have a really nice drive with camo touches right here mm -hmm. and you get that kick up that's, that's just amazing. Up, yeah. I, I think it's totally worth the paying, what is it, $300 more to get this than the original right. one? Right. 100%. This is a really nice hole. It's super stable, light, fast, and look at that, bro. You yep. can see, you can see like it's a better boat than the... Uh, much better than the this Passport. It's a much yeah. better boat than the Passport, 100%. But you still have the Hobie uh, handles. I guess, although the kayak probably holds 400 pounds, you can see it right there, 400 pounds. You also have to take a look at how much the seat holds. Because if you're 400 pounds and you think you're gonna be fine, no, this thing is gonna break. So you gotta make sure that you get something that supports you, you, right? <laughs> <laughs> if, you, if you're like 400 pounds, you might wanna get one of those 360s over there. That's a boat. That's a boat. Because it has the price That's of a boat. It's the price of a boat, <laughs> but, but it's worth it. <laughs> you know what? Uh, the other day I was fishing in uh, somewhere in Florida, and yeah, I do fish, and I catch a lot of fish too. But you guys don't watch that, so that's why you say I never catch fish because you don't watch them. It's not my fault. <laughs> my friend was on the top water, and when it's shallow, he had to bring the drive up, mm -hmm. and I was on the outback, and uh, I don't have the fancy 
but uh, you just feather it out. The problem was I wanted to go in reverse, and I kept I had to keep changing the the settings, and it was a, it was a hassle. Oh. Like I had to like, but with the 360, you just turn that dial quickly. Yep. You go in reverse. You go any direction you want. And if you get shallow, you don't have to bring the drive up. Yeah. Because you have the other stuff, so it's like everything you need in one. Yeah. Because you could use it in shallow water. You could go like if you train yourself you could go in reverse really fast faster than the pulling those cables mm -hmm. so yeah it's like the best of everything very innovative yeah so what do you think i think this is a far better video yeah all right so everything else in the compass is pretty much the same the only difference is that the drive is upgraded